hey, historian, it's time to find out what century you're doing for the timeline. So I did it wrong. I had to redo it because I put the blocks on it and the blocks on a post note, which doesn't work. So remember, each class gets one century. And from that century, they have to find 12 events that they're going to incorporate on the timeline. And of those 12 events, each one of the four STEM values must be represented three times. And it should also include a diversity of things like different demographics and all that kind of stuff. So I wrote with a pen that a student got me from Costa Rica. He's graduating this year. Um, just so you see, oops, can you see? I have B3, A6, B6. I want you guys to make sure I'm being fair. Um, I'm folding each one up. I'm gonna give it a shake. My daughter's texting me because her favorite pair of Nikes broke at school and she is distraught. Okay, here we go. Hold on, let's turn it on. Okay. Oh, they're stuck together. This, I want the suspense to build even more. All right. So B3, B3 is the first one we are spinning for. B3, which one will you get? B3 gets 1,700. Can't complain about that. The revolution, constitution, all sorts of good things. All right. Uh, okay. And now I should have made it to eliminate that one, right? Okay. Oh, well. So which one goes next? Let me see. Do -do 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 -do. The one going next is A6. Can you see it? Probably not. A6. Like the sneakers, just not. All right, so B3 has 1,700. A6 gets 1,800. Oh, you get the Civil War, Reconstruction, the War of 1812. Oh, geez, all sorts of things. All sorts of things, which means B6. I'm running down 1600. So you get all the early colonies, Jamestown, Plymouth, Dutch colonies, all the issues with colonization, the Mayflower Compact, cannibals, issues with Native Americans. All, all, all of them have that, right? Um, so here you go. Let's make this amazing.